Hello from Andreas Holistic Coach, Virtual Secretary. Today, we talk about the journeys of life and soul. Life's journey is long and winding, with ups and downs, twists and turns. There will be times when you feel like you are on top of the world, and there will be times when you feel like you are at rock bottom. But through it all, you will learn, grow, and become stronger. Life's journey is not always easy, but it is always worth it. So embrace it and enjoy the ride. Here are some tips on how to make the most of your journey. Be open to new experiences. The best way to learn and grow is to step outside your comfort zone and try new things. You never know what you might enjoy or who you might meet. Don't be afraid to fail. Failure is a part of life, and it's nothing to be ashamed of. Failure can be a great teacher. It can help you learn what doesn't work so you can figure out what does. Learn from your mistakes. Everyone makes mistakes, but it's essential to learn from them so you can avoid making them again in the future. Don't compare yourself to others. Everyone is on their journey, and focusing on your path is essential. Comparing yourself to others is useless and will only lead to disappointment. Be grateful for what you have. It's easy to focus on the things you don't have, but it's important to remember all the good things in your life. Please list everything you're grateful for and read it over whenever you feel down. Surround yourself with positive people. The people you spend time with have a significant impact on your life. Make sure you surround yourself with positive people who support you and encourage you to be your best self. Take care of yourself. It's imperative to take care of your physical and mental health. Ensure you're eating healthy, getting enough sleep, and exercising regularly. And don't forget to take some time for yourself to relax and de-stress. Live in the present moment. It's easy to get caught up in the past or the future, but it's important to remember to live in the present moment. Enjoy the little things in life and appreciate the beauty of the world around you. Follow your dreams. Don't let anyone tell you that you can't achieve your dreams. If you have a dream, follow it with everything you've got. You never know what you might accomplish. The journey of life is a beautiful thing. Embrace it, and enjoy the ride. And remember, within the journey of life dwells the journey of the soul. The journey of the soul is a long and winding one. It is a journey of self-discovery, growth, and love. It is a journey that is unique to each individual, and it is a journey that is never truly complete. The soul begins its journey in the world of spirit. It is a world of pure love and light, and it is a world where the soul is free to be itself. However, the soul soon realizes it is incomplete in the spirit world. It longs for something more and to experience the world of matter. The soul then incarnates into a physical body. This is a challenging experience, but it is also a necessary one. The soul must experience the world of matter to learn and grow. It needs to know about love, loss, joy, and pain. It needs to learn about the duality of life. The soul spends many lifetimes in the world of matter. In each lifetime, it learns and grows. It accumulates wisdom and experience. Eventually, the soul will be ready to return to the world of spirit. The return to the world of spirit is a joyous occasion. The soul is finally home. It is reunited with its loved ones and free to be itself again. However, the soul's journey is not over. It will continue, from body to body, to learn and grow, and it will continue to experience description. The world is a tale, a big one, with no beginning and no end. We are all characters with different importance, according to some, and no importance at all, according to others. All tales are small rivers contributing to the main one over and over again for eternity. However, it's true that each of us, actors and actresses on the universal stage, consider ourselves the main protagonists of our movies and tell their tales from their winning viewpoints. And so it is, endless winners tell endless stories, and we love to read and hear them because the world is our playground, and we make it the way we want. 
The following are my talks about meditation, reincarnation, past lives, awareness, karma, happiness, reiki, travels, astral travel, vegetarianism, and enlightenment. Pearls of Wisdom is an anthology of short stories touching various metaphysical topics. It moves along the subtle energy trails and explores the different levels of manifestation of the spirit. All the 100 tales result from my direct experience, and they communicate from time to time an essential understanding that contributed joy and intensity to forging and consolidating the fundamental matrix of my being. Pearls of Wisdom indicates the method and attitude of life and takes you on a particular journey where the apparent boundaries of individuality extend towards ever more distant borders to the point of trespassing into infinity. Each tale is independent and complete in itself and touches a critical aspect of the depth of the personal and collective soul and universal teaching, and going beyond the imaginary boundaries of space and time always brings you back to the present moment, where everything, in the end, converges and merges. That's universal teaching. Do you want to know more? Please comment or write in the email. My books are linked in the video description. My music is on the playlist. I invite you to subscribe to the channel and wish you a wonderful day.